what should the punishment be for these kids? They've already been punished. Like, oh, they created an international incident. Let me tell you something. Not only are they not professionals, but what happens, the reason there's basketball being played by American teams in China, be it amateur basketball, in this case, or even professional basketball, is because there's an enormous market to exploit. There's an economic opportunity because China is in many ways economically free. It is not actually a free country. You know, it is a communist country. And so they have been accused of these things. I don't know that they did it. I don't pardon, know what they did. Pardon, and, pardon the fact the pun, that, and the fact But what does that have to yep. do with the price of tea in China? And 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 the fact that the fact that it became an international incident has as much to do with the punishment for for a petty crime up to 10 years in jail. Give me a break. Uh, as it has to do with the crime itself. Should they be shoplifting if in fact they were? Of course not. Should the kids be extra, uh, you know, should their awareness be heightened that if they are the kind of kids that might shoplift, hey, don't do it when you're representing America abroad? Of course they should. But in fact, as minors, the school and the, and the organizers of the event that takes them there are to me as responsible for putting them in that situation as the kids are, number one. Number two, in terms of the actual crime and how bad it was, it, diplomats all over the world, they, they run red lights. It's a lot dangerous. It's much worse of a crime. They have diplomatic immunity, like, and that happens all the time. I, you try to park near the UN. It happens all the, the point is, people go to other countries and sometimes break the law. The, the disparity here in terms of the punishment based on what country you're in and the amount of outrage because it's some amateur college player is out of proportion. Now, well, Cam Newton did get get did get kicked out of school for stealing computers that's true but Jameis Winston took crab legs out of a supermarket nothing happened so why should these kids be punished more they've already been detained in China that's not well, enough of a punishment Stephen a., before, for being accused Stephen a., of a crime they weren't convicted Stephen A before you jump in can I just clarify I just wanted to go ahead so what we're go saying ahead. is if you cause an international incident allegedly if you contribute to an international incident allegedly you skirt a three-year prison sentence in China, and the president of the United States steps in to ensure that you only have to stay at a five-star hotel for a week. You have been punished enough. Just want to clarify, that's where we are. I would, I would say the United, that organizers in the United States should think carefully about sending kids anywhere where you can get up to 10 years in prison for shoplifting. You may not want to be in that kind of country in the first well, place. Well, first, of all, first of all, these are the moments where I get annoyed with you because that has nothing to do with the situation at hand. Let's answer the question. If they are guilty of such a thing, what should happen to them? Max Kellerman, just sit there. I, I mean, let me give you a little secret about the black community, okay? The black community looks at other communities, particularly the white community, and we joke about this. It's nothing malicious or, or anything like that, but we joke about this. Some of y'all might sit up there and put a kid in timeout. We will whip their you-know-what. That's how we roll, okay? It's just, it, call it a black thing. I hope you understand. But that's how we roll. First of all, if I was, if, if I was, if I was LeVar Ball or any of those kids' fathers, that I, I'd be the last person they wanted to see because I, I assure you I would put my hands on them. I would deal with them. That's number one. Number two, at the very least, is suspend them Shown half the season. Shown to be ineffective, at the, by the at, way. At, 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 oh, wait, wait. Okay. That, that's ignorant. I don't give a damn. Wait, this ain't open. No. No, actually, no, 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 actually, no, no. I don't want to hear. Oh, actually, stop. that don't point of view is don't ignorant. Get, oh, no, no, please. Yeah, I, by I'm definition, glad it's ignorant. So. Uh, by, by whose definition? In what world? In what world? People who actually this, researched this, 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 it, Oh, no, oh be research, research. Really, they ain't show yeah. up in the black community. I promise you that. They ain't show up. I want to hear that, okay? The fact is, these dudes should be suspended at least half the season. I'm not going to say the whole season, but they should be suspended for half the season. You embarrassed yourself. You embarrassed your family name. You embarrassed the university. You're assuming that we're assuming that there's guilt because we wouldn't be talking about it if we didn't think that they were guilty of shot. I don't, I don't think the president, is, I don't think, really? You don't assume guilt? All right, that's fine. If they're innocent, no. of course, then there's no need to talk about it. Then you didn't, you didn't need to go on with your soliloquy then. You should have said, I don't believe not they're guilty. Not true, because I have they were accused. All right, all right, all right. 
the bottom they were accused. Line is, they didn't have a trial. The bottom, we're talking about it because we believe because all the parties that were involved that there and, and video, by the way, to go with it. We believe that there's a strong level of guilt. That's the only reason we're talking about it. If you're guilty of shot, okay, let's assume going guilt. out the country, going out the country. Thank you. Going out the country, going to three separate stores, stealing, representing UCLA, representing your family name. You showed them a lesson. This is no lesson. You benched them for half the season, and you make sure that that something like that doesn't happen again. That's what you do. All right. This this. You suspend them for the entire season. And this may come as a surprise to you, Stephen A., probably not. But I'm not necessarily a timeout kind of guy. Um, I don't think it's a black-white thing. I think there's ways to impose punishment that need to be, uh, that need to resonate very loudly in certain situations. But I'm also a guy that gives second chances, Max. And you also know this. I'm also a guy that really, really, really tries to give as much adherence until innocent until proven guilty in the concept of allegations. But one thing that's not an allegation is that you are part of an international incident here. So you have, as Seth Greenberg pointed out, embarrassed your family, embarrassed your school, and to some extent embarrassed the country. If not for the intervention, and we have to give credit when credit is due. And all three of us at times on this program have criticized the President of the United States, and in my opinion, rightfully so on many occasions. But we have to give credit where credit is due. He has to be given credit on this one. He steps Absolutely. in, and hours later, our American boys are returned back to American soil. Well, That's can what I, has can to I happen. interrupt you for one second? Sure. Actually, the President just tweeted, and he said, Do you think the three UCLA basketball players will say thank you, President Trump? They were headed for 10 years. In jail. Well, so see, just now, wanted to add that to your point. Well, see, now sometimes we don't have to give credit because he'll take it for himself anyway. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> but yes, if you if you're on rea if you have a reality <laughs> TV show, he'll intercede. That's that's for sure. But well, look, look, I don't know if that's the connect, Max. I don't. And know I'm if glad that's that he did. Line. And I'm glad. By the way, well, beca because because it's a high publicity case for which he can take credit. But I'm glad that he did intercede. Or, it's a good thing. 